So, why is North your favorite team? Well, the FC Copenhagen uh, association was just great, and having Cajun come back after being kicked from Astralis was just something that really was inspiring. Now they have Valde, a young gun to the scene at least, even if he is older, and Config just going off with MSL's veteran leadership. First, I started to watch. Uh, first, I started to play CS:GO. Uh, maybe the NIP was the first team what, where what team I watched it from Twitch. And of course, when Alu came to skin to NIP, I don't know. I don't know. The people, the NIP people, players are so. I don't know. I like them. I like them as a person. Yeah, I have to go with the face clan. Yeah, I'm rooting for face. And why? I don't know, maybe because they're all five is, uh, superstars and it's like exciting to see five big names and uh, how they're going to be a big name, big team together and uh, how they manage their egos because they are all are amazing players, they have their own, own e like, uh, egos, so how they can be a good team. And that's why. Uh, I like them and all the players are very friendly and when we was at the signing session uh, yesterday they was very nice and they talked a lot to us. Uh, I think that's an important thing in esports, being nice to, uh, that's how we get fans, being nice. And uh, of course they're really skilled and good at the game and that's also fun to see and it's uh, fun actually being here live when they are going to play a final. Uh, very fun team and uh, I've always uh, liked Apex and Kenny S, uh, very good players. And uh, I think it's fun because they're French and they're very funny. So it's become kind of a meme with the baguettes and stuff. Uh, and then I've always liked, um, depend not depending on if they're in G2 or if they're in uh, Envias, but I've always followed Kenny and Apex. Uh, and it's great to see that they're actually doing really good in this tournament. Uh, so of course we're going to support them all the way. And um, who's your favorite player in North? Uh, my favorite North player is probably Valde because I really liked the uh, heroic come up story and how he was with them and Glaive, how he went to Astralis. So he's definitely taken my favoritism, but otherwise Config, always ever present. I th it's get right, yeah. Get right, get right, because uh, he's as a player, he's really good, but as also as a person. I have to say, I have to say Olaf Meister. Now, when he got the face clan, he's a great addition to the team and uh, he's just amazing. He's a veteran and he's still looking good. Uh, it's really hard actually because they're all really good at the game and good at different things. But I believe I would pick... Uh, I think I would pick Shox because he's really good at like offing at pistols with rifle and everything. And he's also the, the in-game leader and it's really hard to... Or it's kind of hard to frag an in-game lead as well, but he's, he can do it both at the same time, so that's why I like him. Uh, Kenny S, uh, I'm an opera myself, and I really like his style of playing. Uh, and uh, ever since I started playing CSGO, I've always watched highlights of him playing. Uh, and I think he's uh, the best opera uh, ever. Uh, even though he's had his lows, he's always come back stronger. Uh, and he's been playing really good this tournament. Uh, so I hope he can play even better in the finals. So, what do you think about NIP's fair performance here? And why did they lost? Well, of course, there's a new players. They they played really well. Of course, they had things to do, to practice and stuff. But they went really good. Like these new new players. So why why did they lost? <laughs> so <laughs> why? Well, I don't know. I don't want to blame anyone, but maybe some Drake or NIP shots. Maybe. He maybe he had to like get more shots. Of course, he got like flick shots, but some basic shots he didn't get it. So, of course, I don't want to blame like one people, but they have to just practice more. Yeah. Why did Faze Faze lose in this tournament? I don't know. Because the roster changes came like uh, it, how it's been, it's been like. Uh, a uh, few weeks with the new roster, like the first tournament with the new roster, so it takes time to every everything to click. And I don't know, it was a close game against Gambit, and but it happens sometimes. But I will next tournament face will be a big name. Maybe he'll, they win it. 
And uh, last question, um, what do you think uh, of North's performance here? And uh, what's your prediction for the final? I think the North will take it 2-1, first of all. But I do think that AZ not being in a slump and finding his footing in spots and Valde's flexibility because of what he did in uh, Heroic and the style that they played really brought back what they had with Rubino back at the E-League Major and before that and their run at Epicenter. I think that Config has been just playing consistent and great, similar to how Adrin was whenever Gambit was playing great. And MSL playing the entry frag role and really taking the hit in stats but not being the one to close out rounds really opens it up for players like Cajun to excel with the off in his mid-round. So your prediction is 2-1? Yeah. 2-1 yeah. for G2? No. <laughs> 2-1 for North, for sure. 16-0, uh, 2-0, two, both maps. G2-0, 16-0, 16-0. OK, thank you. Thank you.